the message. What is this message? This message, of course, is the gospel of Christ. Firstly, the gospel of Christ is a message of repentance. It is a message of repentance. Jesus' first recorded words, according to Matthew, after he started, or as he started his Galilean ministry, after being led up into the wilderness for 40 days, being tempted by the devil, he came back and the first thing he said was, repent. The very first thing Jesus, the first thing he came out of his mouth was, repent. His message, family, this message that we are to carry out to everyone, to the nation, is a message of repentance. If we leave repentance out of this message, then there is no salvation. Then the, the power that the word has will have no effect. So we can't go about, listen, listen, we're talking about effectively evangelizing. We can't go about trying to evangelize folks taking the message to the, to the nations, discipling our loved ones, our friends, our neighbors, our co-workers, if we're not preaching. Second, this message is a message of faith. Faith. Not just any faith, family, but it is a faith in God and in the work that Christ did on the cross. See, we are, we are saved by, the, by faith in Jesus Christ. Nothing that we do on our own. We don't have to go pay anyone. We don't have to go get on our knees and, and pray the rosary. No, no, we are saved by simply saying, I believe in this work. I believe in what God had, what Jesus did on the cross for me. The, the message is a message without it, we cannot be saved. Salvation depends on the belief in something that is unseen. Listen, many folks are like, well, why would I believe in that? Why would, why would I believe in your message? I can't see this God that you talk about. I see all these other Christians, they're living as hypocrites, living their lives, uh, 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 you know, one way like this. And other. So why would I believe in this message? Well, we have to preach, family, that is faith. Oh, it's faith in God and not necessarily faith in man. Because, yeah, you may see me living, you may see someone else living a different way, but that's not what we're preaching. We're not preaching ourselves. Amen. We're not proclaiming I walk, we're proclaiming the gospel of Christ. Amen. You see, we have to understand that our message, family, has to be the message of the gospel of Christ, not our message. Right. We can't give a watered-down version or a twisted version of our message because our message is tainted. It's coming from a tainted person. Right. I'm carnal, yet carnal. I'm spiritual, yet carnal. You're spiritual, yet carnal. So it has, to, it has to be a message of faith. Amen. 